As the sun dipped below the horizon, casting a warm golden glow over the tranquil waters of Lake Michigan, I found myself standing on the porch of Aunt Martha's cozy holiday home. The gentle breeze carried the soft scent of pine and the distant laughter of children playing in the water. It was a perfect setting for a summer getaway. I had been eagerly looking forward to this trip for weeks, and finally, the day had come. My mother, Aunt Martha, and her mischievous twin daughters, Amy and Stephanie, had all gathered here for a weekend of fun and relaxation. As we settled in, I realized with a sinking feeling that my swimsuit was missing from my bag. My heart raced as I approached my mom, who had a bemused look on her face. Alex, I'm so sorry, I completely forgot to pack your swimsuit, she admitted, her tone apologetic. My disappointment was palpable, but before I could sink into a pit of despair, Amy and Stephanie rushed over. They were about my age but seemed to have boundless energy. Don't worry, Alex. You can borrow one of ours. Amy chirped, her eyes sparkling with excitement. Stephanie added, yeah, we have an extra one that you can wear. Feeling a mix of relief and embarrassment, I followed them to their room. Among a pile of vibrant swimsuits lay a pink one with white stripes. It was cute, but also a little intimidating, given that it was definitely designed for girls. Suppressing a sigh, I muttered my thanks and changed into it. As I stepped out of the room, I saw my reflection in the hallway mirror. The swimsuit wasn't exactly my style, but it fit surprisingly well. The pink fabric contrasted with my sun-kissed skin, and the white stripes seemed to accentuate the color even more. With newfound confidence, I joined Amy and Stephanie at the edge of the lake. The water lapped gently at the shore, beckoning us to plunge in. As I waded into the lake, the cool water embraced me, and any doubts about the swimsuit faded away. We spent hours splashing around, building sandcastles, and racing each other along the shore. The initial awkwardness of wearing a pink swimsuit was replaced by the sheer joy of being in the moment, surrounded by laughter and the serenity of the lake. As the day wore on, the sun began its descent, casting long shadows across the sand. We wrapped ourselves in towels and headed back to the holiday home. I felt a sense of belonging and camaraderie that I hadn't expected, all thanks to that pink swimsuit. That evening, as we gathered around the bonfire, roasting marshmallows and sharing stories, I realized that it wasn't about the color of the swimsuit, but the experiences and memories we were creating together. I glanced at Amy and Stephanie, whose faces were lit by the warm glow of the fire, and I couldn't help but smile. As the stars emerged in the clear night sky, I whispered a silent thank you to Aunt Martha, Amy, and Stephanie for turning what could have been a disappointing moment into one of the most memorable weekends of my life. The next day dawned bright and promising, and the lake glistened like a sheet of diamonds under the morning sun. With each passing moment, my connection to the pink swimsuit grew stronger. It was as if wearing it had unlocked a carefree side of me that I hadn't known before. As the day unfolded, I embraced the feeling of the sun on my skin, laughing and playing with Amy and Stephanie in the water. The swimsuit no longer felt foreign, it was just another part of the experience, an emblem of the incredible memories we were forging. Over time, the swimsuit began to leave faint tan lines on my skin, tracing the contours of its design. It was a testament to the hours of fun we'd been having, a visual souvenir of a summer that would forever be etched in my heart. As the sun dipped below the horizon once again, Amy and Stephanie exchanged mischievous glances. Hey, Alex, how about we make tonight even more special? Stephanie suggested, her eyes twinkling. I raised an eyebrow, curious but wary. What do you have in mind? Amy grinned and chimed in, we've got a surprise for you. How about dressing up in one of our black dresses? Just for fun. At first, the idea seemed a bit odd, but then I thought about how much fun we'd had in the swimsuit. I found myself nodding with a grin. Sure, why not? Let's do it. After raiding their closet for the perfect dress, I slipped into the soft, flowing fabric of a black dress that reached my knees. It was a little loose, but the feeling was oddly liberating. Amy and Stephanie helped me with my hair, giving it a playful tousled look. When we arrived at the Italian restaurant, the evening was alive with the aroma of freshly baked bread and the gentle hum of conversations. 
As we were shown to our table, I couldn't help but notice the curious glances from the staff. Amy and Stephanie, who were dressed in their matching dresses, were excitedly chattering away, but I sensed that something was different about the way the waitstaff treated me. Throughout the evening, I was addressed as, Miss, and, Young Lady. The waiter even complimented my dress, mistaking me for a girl. At first, I was taken aback, but then I realized that it was all in good fun. I decided to embrace the role and played along, letting my hair down and enjoying the attention. As we savored the delicious Italian cuisine and shared laughter, I felt an incredible sense of camaraderie with Amy and Stephanie. The unexpected turn of events had transformed a simple dinner into a memory that would forever bind us together. When we returned to the holiday home that night, our hearts were light with the joy of the day's adventures. As I changed out of the black dress and into my own clothes, I couldn't help but feel a pang of nostalgia for the moments I'd spent as, Alex the adventurous girl. The rest of the weekend was a blur of laughter, games, and shared experiences. As the time to leave approached, I looked out over the serene waters of Lake Michigan, my heart full of gratitude for the unforgettable journey I had embarked on. In the end, it wasn't about the color of the swimsuit or the dress, but about the memories we had created together. I realized that sometimes, stepping out of your comfort zone can lead to the most unexpected and cherished moments of your life.